Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about closure of attribute sets. Suppose there is a set of functional dependencies f specified on a relation schema R. Let x is a set of attributes. Then the set of all attributes functionally determined by x under a set f of functional dependencies is called the closure of x under f and it is denoted by x plus. Now if we have a set f of functional dependencies specified on a relation schema R and a set of attributes x which is a subset of R. Then how we can find the closure of x under f which is denoted by x plus. First we will set x plus to all the attributes in x. Then we will perform this step. In this step, for each functional dependency from y to z in f, we will check if y is a subset of x plus or not. If y is a subset of x plus, then we will add all attributes of z in x plus. This step is repeated until x plus does not change. It would be more clear after this example. Let f is a set of functional dependencies specified on relation schema R. f includes these functional dependencies. Now we have to find the closure of this set of attributes under f. This set has only two attributes SSM and P number. Let X denotes this set of attributes. X plus denotes the closure of X under F. So what will we do? First X plus will be set equal to X. Now X plus includes two attributes. SSM and P number. Now, now we will go through all functional dependencies in F. Now see this functional dependency. Attribute SSM is present in X plus. So we will add ename in x plus right now see this functional dependency attribute p number is present in x plus so we will add the attributes p name and p location in x plus Now see this functional dependency. Attributes SSM and P number are present in X plus. So we will add attribute hours in X plus. After going through all functional dependencies in F x plus has been changed. So again we will go through all functional dependencies in f. Now see this functional dependency. SSN 
is present in x plus. So we have to add e name in x plus which is already present in x plus. Now see this functional dependency. Attribute p number is present in x plus. So we have to add the attributes p name and p location in x plus which are already present in x plus. Now see this functional dependency. Attributes SSN and P number are present in X plus. So we have to add attribute hours in X plus. Attribute hours is already present in X plus. Since after going through all functional dependencies in F, X plus has not been changed. So we will stop there. Closure of this set of attributes under F is this set. Thank you very much.